Hey, what up, legends? How's it going? Q and Bacon here. Now, today, I have a fantastic deck for you, and I've encountered it many, many a times on, on the ladder in the past couple hours, and I wanted to know what all the fuss was about, because I was getting destroyed. And this deck is absolutely insane, so I logged in to Heart Pawn, tried to find where it came from, and, well, would you know it, it's on the top of the new decks uh, hot deck page and i was i was amazed by by the deck it was created by expressos by the way and i'll show you guys in just a moment what it entails but before we do anything there is a mandatory sellout time for me i'm giving away seven hearthstone card packs to one of you guys next sunday we're gonna have a good old giveaway on here and uh well including in that uh, is uh, the requirements for you to uh, be participating in that giveaway, which are quite simple. A, be subscribed to the channel. B, leave a comment down in the comment section letting me know why you should win those card packs, and I will I'll enter you in the draw for those. So, good luck to everyone. Now, let's jump onto the ladder with the heal Zulok and have a blast. I have seen this deck way too many times today and uh well it kind of speaks for itself um it's pretty darn good now there are some people that are asking for some more cards to be put in like glinda or the sea giant and a couple other things like that but overall as the base deck stock th this is extremely this is strong Jane. Extremely, extremely strong. Um, we're going to keep that Cobalt Librarian. It's very good. And, uh, yeah, let's let's go forward. We've got a... Oh, wow. We've probably got one of the most insane one drops. Um, I mean, turn ones. Turn one, Voodoo Doctor, happy goal. And then my opponent's like, oh, shit, a three drop on turn one. Um, as well as a one drop. So that And then next turn is just as insane wait no because zero of your hero was healed this turn. okay wait no i can't do that yet next turn is going to be the explosive turn i have to hurt myself <laughs> i have to hurt myself or else it doesn't count as kill i was about to make a mistake but then you know i played this deck a couple of times i was wondering what was up all right all freaking right so we heal ourselves just like such Play a happy goal for free. We play a couple of librarian, draw another card, and uh, well, I seem to be all set so far. Um, a little trade. This seems like a pretty good turn too. Wouldn't you agree? I I feel like it's a fantastic turn. Oh come on. Amazing. Ugh. Okay, it did the thing that I didn't want it to do, which is very frustrating. And he's gonna ping it and everything. I, I'm, I'm trying to be a little conservative here. Uh, I do still have the board. So that's not too big of a, a problem for me. Voidwalker. Dies. Explosive. We're gonna draw. But... Fret not, we do have some life uh, generating cards in the deck. We have another Voodoo Doctor, we've got two Fungal Enchanters, we also have two Life Drinkers. So we can heal ourselves quite a little bit. But this guy is not happy about what's going on right now. What? That is insane. That, that is an insane turn. Um, I'm going to have to play this. And it is another explosive one. I'm getting I'm getting um I'm getting shit on by this guy. Nope, mm, nope, 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 nope. Oh yes. Yes, very much. That's a trade. And I've taken a lot of damage so far. I still have the board. Um, I'm scared of fireballs and frostbolts and whatnot, so we have to be wary about that. There's a frostbolt. If I can hit my fungal mancer here, though. Oh, yes. 
or that. That's also pretty darn good. Um, I'm gonna just play the fungal uh, enchanter. I, I was like fungal mancer, Oops. fungal enchanter. Not even the same race, but this one is a kobold. This one is a mushroom thing. But this was a very good play. Ooh, okay, well now we it's a, it's a race, isn't it? We're just racing the guy down. Alright, do some more damage. Try to finish him off next turn. Probably not going to work, of course. Um... He only has 8 mana though, so... Unless he has a board clear, which usually is not run in Burn Mage. I wonder. I should be okay. I mean, he's playing Vex Crow Mage, right? So... Looking for... Oh, actually, I didn't know that it worked that way. Well, we win the game anyway, so... Uh, there we go. From what we have on the board. Hey, we get to rank 5. I was rank 8 earlier. Uh, I started before I started playing this deck. Uh, all the way up to rank 5. That's very good. <laughs> My wife was watching a show earlier. I was just testing the deck uh, to see how well it worked. Uh, since I was a little confused about why it was working. Uh, since uh, I've been beaten a couple of times pr prior to starting playing the deck. With this very deck. So I was trying to do some investigating. And uh, well, it turns out it's pretty Gudan darn good. Versus Valera. All right. Th thank you so much, Expressos. I don't know why you thought or how you thought about this, but um, so far I'm quite impressed with the deck. Okay, you don't really care too much about the Voodoo Doctors unless you have the Light Warden or the or the Happy Ghouls. So that's four cards that care about you uh, getting some some heal onto your face. That is a pretty good start. In fact, I would say that is a very good start. I'm going to go on ahead with that. Now, you don't really want to use the Voodoo Doctors without having A, Happy Ghoul, or B, Night Warden. But if you don't really have anything else to play, uh, you kind of have to, don't you? Mm. Yes. We're doing it. Guys. We're doing it. Now, I don't have anything else for next turn, but... I've got a very good board. Come at me, comma, bro. Oh, it's a Kingsbane deck. Okay. Uh, No, please don't. That is very scary. Though we're very aggressive, so we probably are going to be having a decent time with this. Okay. Uh, next turn, depending either Spellbreaker or Fungal Enchanter. The guy's already at 15. Of course, he's got the Legion Poison, so we can start killing my creatures for free. Which really sucks. Um... Okay, so we will play Spellbreaker. Oh. We will not be playing Spellbreakers. I do not appreciate this card at all. This just sucks. And I know he's still going to be at 11 and all. Um, maybe more if he can actually Doomblade or something. That still sucks too. Sprint. Oh, shoot. Dude, he's going to be super low. He doesn't have anything else, right? Oh, he had. Oh, yeah, you got back step. Mm. Okay. Fair enough. Backstab is a fair card. Um, I think I'm just gonna play this Pigable Dreadlord for now. Like it, it's got a big body, somewhat. 
Now he needs to get his weapon back. And he's probably got a way to get it back. But the question is... Does he? Okay. Alright, sure. I'll go on ahead with that. Um, I will play the Voodoo Doctor. And then we'll play this guy again with the Happy Goal. That's three targets. And we've got the Fungal Mancer. So it's going to be much easier for us to actually do something. So he kind of just delayed his death by one turn. Which might as well be the best he could do there. Please don't have another one. Though I don't mind playing the, the Happy Goal for free here. Okay. Fan of Knives kills... My uh, there once was a man from my voodoo duck. That's probably one of the only ducks that you've seen in forever that actually runs voodoo doctor without being a joke duck. Think about that. Voodoo doctor technically won us the game. Oh. Oh, <laughs> I have Kaliseth in opening hand. Uh, I am keeping that. This is good. This is very good. I'm going to keep this hand. I'm going to make my opponent have a hard time here. Oh, okay. Double Voidwalker, Kaliseth. Should I just Kaliseth on turn one? I mean, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I should not. Why do you I'm just gonna play taunts. Which is totally fair. Alright, he's gonna... He's gonna do his thing. You know, dagger up, kill one of my guys. Which is okay. Well, I mean, it's not really okay, but... So Kelisat trade. And the guy's gone. Okay. Oh. Huh. Gul'dan. Okay. Versus Turn Margot. three, I have double three drop. Your soul shall be mine. That's actually pretty tasty by itself. Uh, the only better thing is Voodoo Doctor. <laughs> yeah, Voodoo Doctor. And, and, well, especially even more so if my opponent hurts me. Um, and then now all we need is Light Warden. Or... Or kill us out. Either either would strength. be very, very good for us. Did we have all the heal? Well, I mean, I'll play it. Since I don't really have anything else. Doesn't count because I didn't actually heal myself. All right, I restored nothing. All right. Go ahead. Oh, come on. Okay. That's not fun. That is not fun. I'm going to draw. Oh, Despicable Dreadlord is great against his deck. That is fantastic. Okay, so next turn we can do the thing I said, unless we draw two drop. Um, which is all right. Okay. Uh, so... Well, the other option is where I play Flame Imp, Voodoo Doctor, and Happy Ghoul. Is that better? I think it sort of is, in a way. Because I have three targets. That's sort of better. Oh, 
I have more damaging stats, but less... The less, less, well, the same amount of health. Okay, so that went face. Trades there. He attacks face with his knife juggler, right? Um, and at the end of this turn... That goes face. Oh, that's great. That's actually really good for me. Um, so I can trade here. Here. Play Fumble Enchanter. And now I have the board. And I healed myself for two. So, yay me. That's that's very nice. You know what's not nice? Flame Tongue. Oh, yeah, that's okay. That's actually... That is beautiful. Because Fungal en Oh, wow. Fungal Enchanter is so good. Wow, Fungal Enchanter is fantastic. Well, that's kind of a wash. I Oh, my God. If I played Kobold Librarian, actually. But I really wanted to draw. I should have drawn first. But I still wouldn't have been able to do it. Either way. Either way, it's all good. Oh, hey, what up there? That is also very good. Um, I'm just going to start going face. I am still recording. <laughs> hey, that's fair. Um, see, if I if I drawn first, I would not have... I should still have drawn first. That's my bad. My opponent is almost dead. Flat out. Just already from this. Draw first. This time. Okay. Bring the guy down to three. Life drinker. I could have killed... Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. There was... Okay, I had lethal. I know. Okay, just let's just call this extended BM. If he trades, he's just... Okay, yeah, he's just dead. Um, yeah, let's just not say anything. <laughs> oh, okay. That's even better. Oh, boy. Alright, there we go. You guys see how freaking easy this deck is to play and how terrifying it is? Because it certainly is. It certainly is. Well, at least I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I did make a couple mistakes in the last game, and I'm keeping it in. And I understand that you guys are going to go all in the way in the comments. Be, Kiwi, you're shit at Hearthstone. Yeah, I, I, I know I am. I know I am, and uh, that that is completely fair. But keep in mind that my goal here is to show you guys something new and fun to play with. This is definitely new. This is definitely fresh and interesting. So give it a shot. You're going to have a good time. And I can guarantee you'll climb much higher than I currently am, which is rank 5. So since you, know, you guys are probably a little better than me at Hearthstone in the first place. Um... That's it. I, I'm just lost for words. This deck is just way too fun and way too good to actually exist. Well, actually, right now in my mind, I just can't process why it's just so good and no one thought about it before. Uh, so give it a shot. Have some fun. You'll you'll climb some rank, guaranteed. That was Kiwi and Bacon. Uh, and uh, I'm signing out until the next video. Bye-bye.